Why are fans worrying about Wonyoung and why is she getting criticized so much again? What pictures of Taehyung leaked this time? Let's get into it. There's a possibility that EXO might have a full group comeback and fans really don't know how to act. In a recent interview following his solo debut, Shumin shared that he wants to be on stage and do music as EXO and all I can say is same. Then Sehun chimed in and said, it's just my opinion but I think it'll happen soon. While nothing is confirmed yet on SM Entertainment's part, fans are keeping their fingers crossed. Mamamoo are gearing up for a full group comeback. The girls will return on October 11th with their 12th mini album, Mike On. They even started posting the teaser pictures where they pose in casual outfits and look as gorgeous as ever. Though, fans are more concerned whether Wean is going to be able to join the rest of the members for the promotions of the title track. Recently, Wean sustained an eye injury during Mamamoo's performance at the Incheon Airport Sky Concert K-pop concert as firework dust got into her eye. RBW and the live, Wean's agency, hasn't clarified yet what's going to happen to her upcoming schedules with Mamamoo. At least Wien is doing fine now as she assured fans herself, wishing her a speedy recovery. Nana has confirmed that her tattoos are indeed real. She showed up with lots of tattoos to the press conference for the upcoming movie Confession on September 20th, and ever since then, it's become quite a debate whether her tattoos were real or not. Her agency also said that they can't confirm anything since it's her private life, but Nana has made a confirmation herself. On September 20th, 27th, she attended the press conference for the production of the Netflix series Glitch. She shared that she got the tattoo simply because she wanted to. In Glitch, Nana plays the character of Holpora, who's an alien chaser. On the rumors that the tattoos are stickers and that she just got them to promote Glitch, she explained, Pora has a lot of tattoos and wears colorful outfits. I wanted to put meaning in each of her tattoos, so I carefully chose the phrases or drawing for the tattoo. The reactions to this were mixed. Some think that since this is her private life, whether she got tattoos tattoos or not is none of their business. As an Edison said, she can do whatever she wants. The tattoos match her. Some thought that the tattoos were messy and would affect her career as an actress as they would prevent her from getting roles. A commenter wrote, If she wanted to get them, she knows the consequences. She knows what door will open or close because of her tattoos. They look great on her and she's such a queen for being so open about them despite knowing the consequences. Taehyung and Jenny's safety has been put at risk once again. User Gurumi Haribo on Twitter, who has posted all the Jenny and Taehyung pictures until now has posted new photos. In these ones, Taehyung can be seen lying down next to a cat, which looks a lot like the cat that Jenny's mother owns. In another picture, Taehyung is with the cat again, now lying on a bed that has the same bed sheets as Jenny's. A video was also released where Jenny is filming the same cat. That's not all. The hacker leaked other pictures in which a couple, who are suspected to be Taehyung and Jenny, are seen enjoying a romantic date at a restaurant in Gyeonggi province. They claim that the picture was posted either by Jenny or Taehyung Young in their private accounts with the caption, You're my other half. At this point, fans are wondering why neither Hybe nor YG Entertainment aren't taking any measures against this. Even if the photos turn out to be edited, the pictures at Taehyung's apartment or those on Jenny's bed had to be taken somewhere, so it means that the two are hacked. And if they aren't edited, then the situation is even worse. Considering that the hacker also uploaded a picture of Jenny in the bathtub, we never know how far they're able to go and what private pictures they're going to release. Let's also not forget that Goody Haribo also posted unseen pictures of the rest of the Blackpink members, the most recent ones being from Jisoo's visit in Paris for Dior show. The user even wrote a message to both Jenny and Taehyung saying, Jisoo, if you get this message, please post this unseen picture as a sign that you know Jenny and Taehyung are hanging out and you, among others, cannot speak about this. Jisoo then posted the picture that Gurumi Haribo leaked, fueling the rumors even more. A Twitter user said, Gurumi did that on purpose. She knew Jisoo will probably publish it, so she used it to prove her fake narrative. After Jisoo posted on Instagram, the hacker responded by saying everything they post is the truth. Because of this instance, it is believed that Gurumi Haribo is in fact a YG Entertainment employee or that a YG employee is selling the pictures to them. There's a rumor that Gurumi obtained these pictures through YG staff and is using them to push others to believe that what they're saying is the truth. A netizen speculated, it's definitely an employee who is sharing the photos. Are they crazy? People think that YG and Hybe aren't releasing statements because because if they did, then the relationship would get confirmed. But is keeping the couple a secret more important than the fact that someone is posting very private pictures of the two that both are choosing not to show to the public for a reason? There's also speculation that the pictures are in fact getting posted by an ex-friend of Jenny's, who she allegedly blocked on her private account. In this case, fans are wondering whether there's a possibility that YG and Hybe aren't taking any action because legally there's nothing they can do. A fan said, I don't think there was any hacking. It's just that Jenny has a bad 
bad friend. She just blocked one person from her private Instagram since the beginning of September. Another wrote, everyone is swearing at YG and Hai, but what if the photos were obtained in a legal way? Others are saying that since Jenny and Taehyung themselves are choosing to be silent about this, then the hacker should be able to leak all the pictures and videos that they want. All in all, fans are waiting at the edge of their seats at what photos of the two Gurumi Haribo is going to post next, and whether YG and Hybe are finally going to do something to put an end to this. Let's wait. Fans are seriously worried about Wonyoung's health. It's obvious that she has lost a lot of weight recently, especially compared to the time that she was an Eyes One member and a Produce 101 contestant. The drastic change she went through lately regarding her physical appearance is very obvious, and her immense weight loss is raising concerns among netizens. A netizen posted two of her pictures on an online forum where her frame is skinnier than usual, especially her legs. The netizen wrote, at this point, isn't Jung Won Young starving herself? Then added as a caption, I hope that she's healthy. I'm worried. Turns out that the original poster isn't the only one that's worried whether she's healthy or not, as the commenter seemed equally concerned. One of them said, this is indeed worrying. Does she not eat? This isn't a hate comment, and I know that she's managing herself well, but at this point, it's a bit severe. A netizen thought that the fact that they were commenting on her body in the first place was disrespectful. They wrote, does it make sense to you to ask someone skinny if they are starving and that they look like a skeleton? Stop saying that. This isn't the only thing about Won Young that's been quite a hot topic among netizens though, because her behavior has started a discussion once again. Also, Won Young's actions have been at the center of attention lately, and it's not for a good reason. On September 26th, a netizen made a post on an online forum saying, what do you think of the ongoing controversy regarding Ives' VLive? They attached screenshots of Ives' recent VLive broadcast, where Won Young had asked Iso about her shirt. After noticing the shirt, Won Young said that it looked a lot like the one that she had worn during a music recording. Then Won Young started asking Iso whether she had bought the shirt herself, and even reached to check the tag on Iso's shirt. The whole thing was over once Won Young and Eugene ended up confirming that Iso was in fact not wearing the same shirt. After the live, netizens criticized her for the way she acted. Some thought that she was probably making a lighthearted jab and jokingly accusing Iso of taking her shirt, as the members often share clothes, but people didn't agree. A commenter said, I think this was a bit severe. Look at Iso's facial expression. Another thought that the whole ordeal wouldn't be as bad if Won Young had waited until the live had ended to check the tag. They said, I don't think her action is something to get this much hate over, but that doesn't mean it was entirely right. If she was curious about the shirt, she could have confirmed it after the live broadcast was over. She also got tons of hate for her look at a recent schedule where her makeup was a bit heavier and more noticeable than usual. Criticism towards the stylist and makeup artist would be reasonable if fans really thought that she was being wronged by the team, but hating on her is just ridiculous. A netizen attached a picture of Won Young's look and wrote, was this Jung Won Young today? Why is her makeup like that? Thankfully, the majority of the comments didn't feed into the hate and mostly called out the people sending her so much negativity over something as ridiculous as her makeup. An angry commenter wrote, you always post pictures where Jung Won Young doesn't look good and judge her appearance for it. You guys are freaking disgusting. Poor Won Young is dealing with so much hate from commenters for the dumbest reasons, as people seem to be waiting for her to do something or look a certain way so they can comment on it and bring her down. It's truly disturbing. What do you guys think? Share your thoughts in the comments, and I'll see you next time. Bye!